are going to start in Virginia Beach. Hundreds showed up at tonight's forum to discuss the weekend violence at the ocean front. A very vocal crowd had a lot to say about the shootings, stabbings, and robberies during what was marketed as College Beach Weekend. Ten of your sides, Jason Marks, joins us now live with details. Jason. Well, Nicole, it was standing room only at tonight's meeting. Now, the meeting was not organized by city officials. It was held by Councilman Bill DeSteff, who's running for state delegate. With that said, hundreds showed up to voice their concerns over what happened over the weekend. We have the same crowd problem every night during the summer season. It wasn't nearly as big as the crowd at the oceanfront over the weekend. My son's safety is paramount to me and my wife. We enjoy the beach, but we don't want the mayhem going on. But Wednesday, this crowd of Virginia Beach residents made their voices heard. We are a seasonal business. We depend on a, a small window of opportunity to do business at the oceanfront. More than 500 people crowded the convention center to hear what city officials have to say about the chaos that took place over the weekend at the beach. Hopefully, you know, with just a little more police presence, you know, maybe it'll keep some of these kids, even, you know, whether they're locals or out of towners, but just keep them in line a little bit better. I think my question to you would be was if you can tell us what you can't do right now, um, maybe you can tell us what you can do to avoid something like this in the future. City officials admit they weren't ready for the large group that flocked to the oceanfront and resulted in shootings, stabbings and robberies. 148 people were arrested. I don't go down to the beach at night anymore. I don't even go running during dusk. I don't feel safe. The violence is one thing, but what bothers residents like Glenda Fiscus was the lasting image a weekend like that will leave. It gives us a black eye. The people are here acting the way they do because they know the city will not do anything about it. With the proper arrangements in the future, it could be a whole lot better not just for the students, but also for the city as well. City officials say there are no laws to prevent loitering or profanity. And to be very honest, there was a void of knowledge of what was going on this weekend. In the end, residents hope city leaders learn from mistakes. I think we need to think beyond not having these people come here again versus they're going to come again. What is your plan going to be? Now, organizer es organizers estimated about 800 people showed up for tonight's meeting, so very large crowd. Now, this was not a night of solutions. This was really a night to voice concerns and maybe throw out some ideas. Councilman DeSteff says he'll take everything he heard tonight back to city council, and then they'll look for some solutions. That's the latest here in Virginia Beach. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.